Sagittarius, let's find out what is going on for you today, Sagittarius. Let's get a few cards. So let's see here. We've got two cards in reverse and two cards in the upright. There you go. Let's see. What is this? Five of Wands is in the upright. So there's some kind of competition. There's some kind of argument here. This could have to do with uh, the fact that somebody is no longer single or somebody doesn't want to be single anymore. So they're competing for attention, possibly with you. Nine of Swords, somebody is very anxious, Eight of Pentacles reversed, because uh, some kind of manifestation is not working for them, uh, some kind of the conflict they're trying to cause is not working for them. So let's find out what is going on here, who are these people going against you? This could also be uh, internal conflict that you're going through right now, you feel like things are not working for you, maybe this has to do with work, not love. With the Eight of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles both being in the reverse. It could be that there are some financial difficulties happening here. And that's why you are very anxious here. Five of Wands. There could be lots of people trying to cause you conflict at work. Or if you are unemployed right now, there could be people you've had issues in the past at work who are trying to cause conflict so that you don't get another job. These people might be spreading rumors about you in... Um, your field of work to other business owners, to other employers. Is that the case? Let's see. Yes, that's exactly what's going on here. So this love message is more about, um, is more of a work message, but it has to do with your emotions, right? Because it's affecting you mentally and emotionally. So let's see what, what advice do we have in this situation? Not Eight of Swords. This talks about, um, self-sabotage being uh, trapped in a mental prison so i don't know what kind of advice this is maybe this is highlighting the fact that uh you could be sabotaging yourself dude like you're overthinking it let's see what what other advice do we have please five of pentacles you're unemployed right now and you're very stuck you are manifesting from a place of uh feeling trapped and uh a place of lack so um this could be more inner conflict maybe the, these are not other people who are causing you the conflict it could be that your own mindset is the problem here it is not other people am i right is this your own mindset yes you have some kind of trauma you could have cptsd look 999 it's like an angel you see with wings the nine with the two nines here this is similar to what I got in the Scorpio reading, but in the Scorpio reading I had something else. It was about some kind of um, abuse. It was financial abuse in the family. So I don't know if you're dealing with somebody, something similar. Um, maybe you resonate with that reading too. So you feel like you're trapped, like you're unemployed and you're trapped and you cannot get a job. Is this because of another person like in the Scorpio reading? Let's find out. Nine of Cups, that's wish fulfillment. Oh my God, all the nines are here. Look at that, all the nines came out. But um, the divine is on your side. You need to pray for inspiration and you need to pray for help from the divine to show you a way out of your predicament. Because you could be unemployed because somebody is preventing you from getting a job. Because this person wants to control you financially. So pray for the angels, pray to the angels and to God to show you the way out of this situation. And you might have to reach out for help from somebody. I am drawn to take this card here at the edge. Six of Pentacles reversed. I don't think you have actually reached out for help anywhere. You might feel like there's no one who can help you. You might feel like nobody's going to help you if you reach out. So pray to the divine to show you how or who you need to reach out to let's see two of wands there could be somebody who's watching you who's surveilling you of course this could be uh, if you are in a relationship with um, somebody who's abusing you they could be surveilling you they could be watching your every move but it could be that um, the police is watching too or there's another person who's watching who is watching six of wands so 26 could be significant for you it could be a fire sign, Aries or Leo. The two of wands and the six of wands. This could be somebody who um, gets a lot of attention. 
can this person help you in any way? Oh, another thing. In the Scorpio reading, there was a Leo also. Somebody needed to reach out to a family member who is a Leo. So maybe this is a Leo indeed. Maybe they're born on the 26th. That would be the 26th of um, July, right? If they're a Leo. Am I right? Yes. So, uh, not necessarily, but it could be a Leo in, who is a family member. Yes. Oh my God, this could be your father. King of Pentacles. This could be your father or this could be an ex-husband. But I think this, this is your father that you need to reach out to for help out of your situation. I hope this helps. Take care.